everybody welcome back to my channel tonight we are having movie night and i just wanted to bring you along and show you how i created this fun space for our family my children have been wanting to see peter rabbit at the theaters for some time now and i just haven't had it in me to go to the movies yet i'm bringing movie night home it took a little bit of preparation but in the end it's all worth it and just making these memories with my kids First thing I did when preparing for today's night was I made these super easy concession stand food trays. They are made out of old cereal boxes. And I just cut out a placement for a cup, for a popcorn, and for our pizza. So we held out on dinner tonight. So our dinner is gonna be pizza from one of our favorite pizza shops. And I ended up baking some chicken wings. So we are gonna have a double cinema tonight. The first movie, we are gonna enjoy pizza and wings. And then for our second movie, that is when we're gonna have sweet treats. That's when we're gonna have all the dessert. So I ended up putting us together a family snack board with just different, all the movie theater favorites that I could think of. I just stopped by a local dollar tree and just stopped into their candy section and I just grabbed a bunch of things and I'm gonna just put together on this little graze board so we can add them into our popcorn to make it a little bit sweet and salty or we can just pick and choose what we want off of this board as well. Candies and sweet treats, pretzels and chocolate, the, all those movie theater snacks that you have, I put that on our snack board. I thought it would be fun to have some watermelon lemonade. I have been having plenty of watermelons coming in from the garden. We haven't been able to eat them all, so I've been making different beverages and different things with it. I thought it would be fun to have watermelon lemonade as our movie drink, so I just prepared them in some mason jars I did a mixture of regular lemonade and then I added in some of the, some of the watermelon lemonade and I threw in some fresh fruit, added some fresh lemon and some fresh watermelon chunks to it and a sprig of mint. Then I just topped them with our mason jar tops and then we'll be able to have those with the lids and the straws. And so along with the along with our movie theater beverages, we are gonna have these Mickey cups. So these Mickey cups are our favorite. These were a keepsake from the cruise. We ended up buying these the night that we watched a movie on the cruise. We ended up watching Beauty and the Beast. It was like a live performance and they had popcorn and they had these for sale. So we purchased these and every time that we have a movie night in our house, we definitely use these. So I didn't want to put the watermelon lemonade in here because this cup has kind of like a weird shape. I think it would be a little difficult to clean so I'm just using this for our water I'm just gonna add some spring water if we just need water versus the watermelon lemonade we will have these as well we're not gonna eat all of this obviously it's a lot but it's just it's just fun so diving into our popcorn I always make our popcorn on a stove top It's so easy to do. I just prefer to do it that way. I just top it with salt and then we'll be able to just add it into our little individual popcorn boxes. After I did the popcorn, I ended up just getting the nacho dish together. So I'm gonna heat up the cheese for just a few seconds prior to us eating it. Just use our meal prep glass containers and just added some queso to it and threw a couple of Tostitos in there. So after I got all the food and snacks put together in the kitchen, I head over to our movie theater area and I get things cozy over there. I like to turn down the temperature and get a little bit colder. Some more movie theater vibes, you know in the movie theaters it is freezing. So I like to lower the temperature a little bit and just get a little bit cooler. So we have leather couches. So I also like to lay out blankets on top of the cushions because sometimes when you lay on leather, it can be kind of cold as well. And since I'm already lowering the temperature, I don't want it to be too 
too cold. So I am just gonna top the cushions with some blankets, add in some more additional pillows. Then I'm gonna get a little basket put together with some additional blankets that we can just use to cover up and snuggle up with once the movie gets started. Got um, our movie set up on the TV and we have our surround sound all ready. So that's it for today's video you guys hopefully you enjoyed if you did please like comment and subscribe and make sure you turn on your notifications